Here's another item that uh, you may not use very often, but when you have to use it, uh, you're going to love it because this is a diamond drill bit, or, and this is a diamond core bit actually, and a diamond drill to go with it. Now the difference between this for drilling concrete is this has no percussion. This is just a standard drilling action, okay, like you would with your home drill. Uh, no uh, hammering action, and um, so you can use this uh, to cut through tile, um, any uh, ceramic, of course, concrete, and now the reason that you do is use this for concrete and you wouldn't use your carbide bit is because this is diamonds and this will cut through your rebar or your steel. And uh, that's the difference between using the carbide. The carbide with the percuss percussion action, even though there's many different grades of carbide, of course, but uh, in mining, of course, they are some that uh, will drill through rock and everything. But um, the particular ones in core bits uh, if you start hitting uh, steel and rebar, that's when you break off the tips and hence you stop being able to drill. Or you, if you try to keep drilling, you're just going to ruin your core bit or your drill bit. So you'll go to a diamond core bit if you know that there is rebar or steel or you have the feeling that there is in your, uh, in your concrete. Uh, this has a, a hose attachment It's because you will drill using water. That'll keep it cool. And uh, so you would hook up your hose. Now this is a very big core bit. This is a six inch core bit. Here's a smaller one, a three inch. Uh, you can, you could you have a two inch or one inch. Uh, but your drill determines how big that you can use. Uh, and how, this is the maximum here for using with uh, this size uh, core bit. You'd use a six inch with this size drill and you'd have to get a bigger drill if you're starting to go into eight inch, 10 inch. Uh, again, all the equipment is tailored to the job. Now, if you're going to use these on a wall or anything, or hold these up, uh, even this size, you know, make sure you put a V-block on the wall and anchor it in and rest the end on it so that it doesn't walk around the wall on you. You can use them by hand, uh, but probably uh, an easier way is to use them like a drill press. You would take off the uh, cover plate on here and adapt this onto your drill stand. All right, this handle will come off and this will go on the stand to be used like this.